came up with the word happy holidays, well, he has to be a Yankee because he has the brains God gave a bag of rocks. I mean, whoever put happy with holiday never had to endure all the work involved in the Southern holiday. Can I get an amen on that? That's right. Why? Even our very own happy, well, she's only about cheerful this time of year. <laughs> now, if you don't know, I'm not talking about just Christmas or Hanukkah or Kwanzaa. I mean, there are just so many Southern holidays this time of year. Well, of course, the first one I'm talking about is Black Friday. <laughs> now, how, how early did y'all get up? <laughs> well, Three thirty. Well, you did better than me because we got to Target at four thirty, and we were already late. <laughs> Why that line was down a mile long, almost to the hospital. And I started walking up, and I was just going to ask a question, and all of a sudden, this whole, all these people, they started going, "Hold that line!" <laughs> Hold that line! Well, I didn't think they were talking about me. I just thought I had skipped to the next holiday. The Georgia, Georgia Tech holiday. <laughs> well, she got who won that, by the way. Good on. Good on. Now, if you don't think that Southern football is, is sacred and deserves the title of holiday, well, you just need to go to, to one of Tawanda's tailgate parties for the Falcons games. <laughs> That's right. Why, my, my aunt... She always used her silver and china at the Auburn games. She said, a southern lady is judged by the table that she sets. Amen. But you know, she never could get the insurance company to pay for all those scratches on the hood of her car. <laughs> <laughs> but now back to the shopping day, because of course that is the most important one. There are two kinds of people in the world, and you have to decide what kind your family is. They're the people that like to be surprised by their presence. And then there's the people that they want you to get what they want you to get. And if they have a coupon for it, they'll give it to you. <laughs> now, my family is on the second category. We start our list on Thanksgiving afternoon. And you better be on there or you ain't going to get no presents. Now, my poor little nephew, he was 10. And he just, he was just so indecisive, he just couldn't think of a thing that he wanted. And I told him, I said, okay, it's going to be a sad day when you don't get a present. <laughs> and so he was thinking about it, thinking about it, and of course I forgot. And uh, I went and got in the car, and he comes running out of the house, and he goes, Aunt Susan, I could really use a pair of socks. <laughs> By God, that's what he's going to do, a pair of socks. You know, isn't it a shame that they start out being indecisive that way and just keep growing the same way? <laughs> but anyway, I try to get on the list too, but you know, somehow I'm just not getting what I ask for. Every year I put down that I want a handsome widower who's financially stable whose mother has already died. <laughs> In this economy, I think employed with health insurance. <laughs> now, I know that all you modern people here think you can do all your shopping online, but where's your holiday spirit? I mean, and besides, I just think it's a passing fad. I mean, it just doesn't work for me. <laughs> you know, I tried it this year. And my poor little old computer, I mean, it just would not add anything to my cart. So I called Mike Crozier on the phone, <laughs> and he didn't answer me. <laughs> I think he's got my phone number blocked. <laughs> Bless his heart, I keep trying to tell him it was a mistake when I called him at 1 o'clock. <laughs> so I had to go and talk to the person on the, the phone number on the screen, you know. Well, they were just the rudest things, my goodness gracious. They wanted me to tell them what I had already done. And I said, honey, if I knew that, I would have had to call you. And he just kept going on and on about where I was supposed to put my cursor. And he 
just made me so mad, I was about ready to tell him how he could put his poster. <laughs> and he just said, ma'am, he said, you just have to put your cursor down, right click. And I said, it doesn't work. He said, well, you're just doing it wrong. Well, you just don't say that to me. <laughs> and I said to him, excuse me, I am clicking with my right hand as hard as I can. It's not doing a thing. <laughs> and you know he hung up on me. <laughs> and I just looked at that phone, and I said, happy holidays. <laughs>